Okay, guys, got my uh, my knife. Let me see if I can open this up with one hand. Oh, I did it. Okay, so I got the desk from FedEx finally. It only took forever. Uh, yeah, it's all set up in here. I mean, it's kind of weak. The packaging kind of sucks. Right now, I'm set up in the dining room with my with my setup. My nice gaming computer and all that, and the headset. So this is my setup right as of right now. So I got one of those old, I got one of those uh, tables. What are they called? Um, got it from Walmart, eight foot or six foot table. Um, so not a bad setup. Uh, but right now. I'm going to unbox this, uh, spread everything out, take it out of the packaging, all that stuff, and then try to set it up or put it together. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright guys, so empty box and this is all the crap. The legs, all that stuff. This is all bottom pieces, the tools, the mat or the mouse pad cover, um Katie's jacket and <laughs> uh the bottom of the desk. Okay, I'll come back later and Maybe I'll uh, shoot it when I'm putting it together as well. Alright. Alright guys, so uh, it was a pain in the butt putting this desk together. For real, pain in the butt. But it looks badass, it looks sweet, and everything like that. So, um, this is my old, what do you call it, desk or whatever. It's one of those Costco's uh, six uh, six foot desk or whatever, but you can use it for like three screens, three 30, 32 inch screens and, uh, your computer. Um, but I wouldn't suggest putting any kind of computer CPU or whatever you want to call it on top of here. Uh, just because of weight, it'll no monitors, no problem, whatever, but I wouldn't suggest doing that. Um, so, but, uh, you can put other things on, I guess, because, you know, it, it might be sturdy, but, you know, I'm just saying, for me, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do it just because I'm afraid it would fall through. Even though it's a, you know, a, a thick plastic and you got metal legs, you know, plastic, weight, they don't really go together. Bend, break, sure. But, I don't know, I didn't really put it through its um, uh, motions. I just used it for a desk. Alright, but yeah, this thing is pretty cool. It, it, Like I said, it is a pain in the butt putting it together. But, uh, 
you need two people to figure it out. Um, so yeah, so I've got this other little table with my microphone hooked up to it. Um, I am looking for, if you can suggest to me in the comments or whatever, um, they could be shelves or something like that to attach to um, the desk so I can use for, you know, my TV for right now and my monitor for right now. Um, I mean, neat. This stuff works great for my eye level because I'm 6'5 and it doesn't matter how I sit in a chair. I'm very uncomfortable and, it, and my vision is not that great. So I need something that's more to, you know, my eye level. So when I'm sitting in the chair, here, let me bring it over. When I'm sitting in the chair, sorry about that. When I'm sitting in a chair, normally, okay, so my eye level is right, like right here. So this is perfect for when I'm editing uh, music or um, editing uh, videos or anything like that okay perfect uh, I want to get another monitor uh, better monitor whatever uh, this one is a 34 uh, a Viotech 34 uh, ultra wide curved so I want to get another one of these. Uh, I was going to sell it, but it's a pretty decent screen, and it does everything I want it to do. And I can get it up to was it a uh, hundred, a hundred hertz. So yeah, might as well keep that. So, anyways, I've uh, okay. I'm gonna go down to this uh, computer. This. Um, Skytech games. Now I've seen a lot of bad reviews about this computer, okay? And uh but I still bought it anyhow. Because just because you're getting a bad review doesn't mean the right person's reviewing it or they got the right deal or whatever. Um because there's a lot of computer um nerds that uh, computer nerds that are um, stuck on themselves, like, they think they're better than everybody else, or whatever, and they know better than you. So, I got this thing, it was a little bit under $700 through Amazon, okay? It had 8 gigs of memory in it, so I bought an additional 8 gigs of memory, so I have the dual channel. It's a pretty decent computer, okay? It's a lot better than what I had before. I, what, what I had before, here, let me go in the other room. I'll show you what I had, or what I was using, okay, uh, is this HP, okay, HP. This is a business computer, not a gaming computer. Uh, the only thing that would make it a gaming computer, um, and uh, I'm talking low-end gaming, is that I got a, a video card um, for VGA, HDMI, and DVI. So I got that. Um, and then I upgraded from the 8 gigs of memory to the 16 gigabytes of memory. Okay. And that's an i3. And that's a, I think it's like the first or second gen i3. So it's not that great. But it does work. It does it what it's supposed to do. Like, you can't stream with it, um, but you can play video games with it. You know, like, you can play Command and & Conquer and, and Fortnite and, you know, and some lower-end games like Madden, stuff like that. You can play games like that online, but you can't play with other people, okay? And you can't do uh, any streaming, like, on... Um, Twitch or or um, uh, uh, YouTube or or St or Steam or whatever you can't do any of that stuff. It won't allow it because it's just not um, good enough for that. You know, it just doesn't. The processor isn't good enough, and all the other factors that lead into it are not good enough. 
Um, so what I have here is I've got a 500 gigabyte SSD inside. Okay, and then I've got, is it right here? Yeah. I've got a one terabyte external hard drive that I put all my good, all my stuff on here. Um, so, but I don't put games on here. I put like video, music. I used to be a DJ. I used to be an a &R for Universal Records and Sony. I don't do any of that stuff anymore. Oh, I got a little split here, so it's, I just noticed that. Oh, well. I don't know. I don't know why it's doing that. Why it's like that, but it could be because of the curve or whatever, but it's just not fixing. Anyways, <laughs> so back to the computer. So I got the scissor mic. I'm not a fan of the scissor mic. It's a cheap ass mic. Um, and the rubber bands that are supposed to hold up the mic are not uh, holding it up. I mean, I've got a couple of them, you know, rigged, but whatever. And then I've got the 5-in-1 uh, speaker set up. So if you can see, 1, 2, 3, uh, 4... And then come all the way over here. Five. So five and one. And it gives a pretty good sound. I, li I do like the uh, keyboard that uh, came with the uh, computer with the SkyTech. You know, you can change all that stuff, you know. If you like the RGB, which I'm not a fan, but I do like uh, the backlight so I can see at night because my vision is horrible. Um, so I got a little camera there little camera there and then obviously the camera I'm using <laughs> for my uh, vlogs and whatever I will be showing my face more often uh, I'm going to be doing car reviews in the spring uh, spring is right around the corner so when I start to do when I start to walk a little bit better uh, I do have neuropathy of, you know, I understand everybody's got issues and stuff like that but I've got walking issues, um, and I'm on a new medication, and it's, it helps, and it doesn't help. So, anyhow, well, let's go back to this. Um, so this is, this, the SkyTech, this is a very good, it's a um, AMD Ryzen 3 uh, processor. Uh, you can upgrade it to a 5 if you wanted to, um, which I might do later, um, but I'm not going to do the work myself. I'm going to hire somebody else to do it. Um, and then I want to get, and I have in my, you know, my parts, is, my parts uh, thing right here. Uh, you can't see it, but I have in there a 1 terabyte hard drive, which... I have to get wiped clean, and then I want to have it as a backup to the SSD on here. Um, then uh, we got this ergonomic uh, CP holder, or CPU holder. It's a pain in butt. I wanted the computer on this side, but because of that brace, that leg brace, I can't have it over here uh, because it smacks it and it and it's not flush in here. Um, I mean, yeah, I could have different RGB things, you know, different colors and all that crap. Oops, I think it just turned off my computer. <laughs> Whoopsies, I sure did. Don't ask me. Uh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh well. Oh, I'll turn back on. Anyhow, uh, so yeah, okay. So it's not this button. It's this button or this button. There it is. So you can change the different colors of them, um, and the different patterns. And there's a whole bunch of different things. I I didn't even look at the catalog. I just See all that crap, and then you press this other button. I think you hold it down, and then 
then you can switch again or you hold this one down okay and then you, you hit it again and it goes and does different things all right or you're screwed oh here i gotta turn on the computer Okay, I screwed something up here. <laughs> oh well, I'll figure it out later. But yeah, it can, it can give, look, look at the blue light still in the back and then the front one change a different color. So, the, the booklet that came with it, I didn't um, save it. Because I don't like, like on computers and stuff like that, I don't need a manual to tell me how to use a computer. I don't need a manual that tells me how to use any of this shit okay oh stuff excuse me shite um because i'll just figure it out and i've been doing that since computers came out you know i'll figure it out um maybe it has to do with my learning disabilities to try and figure stuff out but anyhow uh this uh this stand or whatever this thing uh runs for about 50 bucks okay and right now amazon it's out of stock and if you say anything about my cable management i don't give a shit because it works for me and it's fine i don't care um yeah it's about 50 bucks 55 dollars you can get on new egg or amazon um you might have to google search it uh if it's not available in either place um but yeah it's about 50 55 bucks you know, not including tax or shipping. And then, um, this desk, back at it. This is what the whole video was about, this desk. It is a pain in the butt. The, the manual that it comes with to put it together is pointless. It freaking doesn't do anything. Uh, some of the screws don't even go in all the way. Uh, or they're stripped, or it's messed up. These stupid legs right here, these fuck, these stupid shite legs, okay, are separate. It takes four screws to put these, put this in right here, okay. It is a pain in the fundament. It really is. Okay, here, this is kind of cool, but not really. Rotating cup holder, okay. Well, I've got this table here, so, and this table, plenty of room on my desk. For a, a coffee cup, and then I've got my cup holder, or my, I'm sorry, uh, whatever the, I, for, I forgot the name of this thing. Anyhow, so I've got this, no big deal. Um, not like I'm going to get any spots on a plastic table or on a, you know, you know, a mouse pad. Um, but, yeah, I, I'm afraid, even though this is metal, because it, there's give right there, and you can't do anything. There's only one hole for a screw. Uh, it you can't tighten it, you know. So it's going to be like that. So do I trust putting anything in it? Hell no, hell no. Oh yeah, this is a wall new. It's from Walmart. Okay, wall new 55 inch uh, gaming desk. Okay, and the reason why I got it is because I'll show you in this video Yeah, that kind of sucked. And the leg, I was moving the table from one side of the room to the other because I wanted to be 
on this side. And the freaking leg broke. Right? It broke. I mean, the leg support on the other table broke. I'm like, what the hell? So I sent it back. Got my money back and got this instead. Uh, this is closer to... Um, of, uh, is it Vitess? inch this is closer to it those are the this one and this one and the Vitas 55 inch um, I would say are the best gaming computers and computer uh, desks out there everything else if it doesn't have the T if it doesn't have the T and the T up top like this this whole setup right here I don't know if it's showing you. If it doesn't have this setup, okay, I'm telling you, and it doesn't have the T, don't get it. It's garbage. You gotta get the T, the T frame setup. You gotta get it, or you're pissing your money away. Okay, I've had in the past uh, year probably th three or four gaming computers that were complete garbage. Okay. The these this wall new is $115 through Walmart. You have to go through Walmart to get it. It's a pain in the ass because you got to deal with FedEx and FedEx is bullshit. They don't care about you, uh, and Walmart doesn't care about you either. But if you if you're willing to wait 30 days to get your shit, I would say get this or get or spend a little bit more money and get the Vitesse. All right, my, some of my camera's about to die because uh, I didn't charge it in, in a while. And I've been talking too much. Get it. But like I said, I'm looking for shelves to mount to my um, desk for <clears throat> both of these. Um, and uh, I'm probably going to be looking for uh, a couple 27-inch monitors because I might just go with the 34 and then 227s to go with it mounted on here and everything like that. I don't know. I I just need extra screens to do what I do. Um, Alright guys. Comment down below. I know it's a long ass video. There's going to be other things in the video. Other, other videos of showing, you know, stuff that I bought. And, you know, uh, but it, this is a long review. Please... Like, comment, and subscribe, and, you know, help me out. Uh, when I'm at 57 subscribers. When I get to 100, I might give away something for free um, to, to a lucky uh, subscriber. Uh, but until then, peace, man. Have a good one.